All right, now we all know about the voicemail feature for a long, long time now. When somebody calls you and if you're unable to take the call, the caller will be able to send you a voicemail and that will be available on the cellular network. You'll be able to download it, hear it, and then uh, respond to it. Probably call them back later. Now this voicemail feature is provided generally by the cellular networks, but now Samsung has added this feature on the Galaxy phones. Yes, this feature is now available on One UI 8.5, not on the previous iterations of One UI. Currently, I'm running One UI 8.5 on this Galaxy S25 Ultra, and uh, this is not the official version, of course. This is an unofficial firmware that I have installed on the device, and I'm able to see this particular feature, which works really well. So in today's video, we are going to check out the voicemail feature on One UI 8.5. Without wasting any time, let's dive right into the video. Now, let me first show you where exactly this feature is and then I will demonstrate it and show you guys how exactly this works. Now, let's go to the phone application here. I'll tap on this ellipsis button and go to settings. You can see we have got direct voicemail right here. We have the other features as well, text call, live translate, record calls, call captions, and then comes the voicemail. Let me tap on this. You can see I have already enabled this. It says when you are unable to answer, allow the caller to leave a voice message. You can send calls to voicemail from the more option menu on the incoming call screen. You can also set calls to automatically go to voicemail after ringing for a certain amount of time. You can still answer while the caller is recording their message. You can check and listen to voicemails in the phone application. Now this is pretty cool. Let's say if you are in a situation where you cannot answer the call, you can ask the caller to leave a message. You can uh, you get this option on the calling screen itself. You'll be able to do that. Or if you don't uh, pick up the call, after a few seconds, uh, the caller will be able to send a voicemail. And there is something more interesting about this. I will show you that in a bit. First, let's demonstrate this and see how exactly this works. Here you can also see auto send to voicemail. After five seconds, I selected. Let's select this to maybe 10 seconds or let's say 20 seconds, uh, we can uh, customize the time as well. Now what we're gonna do is, we're gonna make a call from another phone and then see how exactly this works. Now let me make a call to this phone here. Yep, here we have got the calling screen. Let me swipe up for more options. And here we have got direct voicemail option. Now I can tap on direct voicemail, the person you're trying to reach isn't available. Please leave a message at the tone. When you finish talking, you may hang up. Hi, I want to uh, I want to talk to you urgently. Can you call back, please? Now here you can see uh, whatever the other person is saying that is being uh, transcribed as well. And if you want, uh, while he's on the call, if you want to answer the call, you will be able to do that as well. Now let me just disconnect the call. Now let me show you where is this voicemail. Let's go to the uh, recent calls. Now you can see this symbol over here, this shows there is a voicemail. This is a small tiny icon you can see. This is the voicemail icon, let me tap on this. And here you can see it says voicemail, uh, urgent call transcription and answering capabilities. Uh, so let me just tap on this. Yeah, here we go. This is the voicemail. And the thing is, we also have uh, the AI integration over here. You can see we have got this summarize option right there on top, which is pretty cool. Here, whatever the other person has said is in the form of text. And you can also play the audio here. Hi, I want to uh, I want to talk to you urgently. Can you call back, please? See, uh, whatever the other person is saying. That and this is how you can hear the voicemail. And if you want to summarize it, you can just tap on the summary, tap on OK, and you will get to see that summary of that particular conversation. Need to talk urgently and requesting a call back. During the call, the other person's speech is transcribed. I have the option to answer the call. So this is all that, that I just spoke on the call. That's being summarized over here. And we also have this copy option right here. And it doesn't stop there. We also have audio eraser icon also here. So uh, we have got this AI integration for summarizing the call as well as uh, erasing the background noise just in case if you want to use that particular call <laughs> I don't know why is that there but yes we do have this audio eraser option right there for this calls uh, the voicemail as well now this is how the voicemail feature works on one UI 8.5 uh, this is not available in the previous versions of one UI only on the one UI 8.5 this will be made available but we are not sure whether this feature will be up, uh, available in all the countries we will have to wait and see that uh, Samsung generally doesn't make all these kind of features available in all the regions so we will wait and see which feature uh, whether this feature will be made available in all the countries or not but yeah it's a pretty cool feature if you do not have this uh, voicemail feature uh, available on your cellular network then you can always turn this on on your phone and it's actually better to
to turn this on on the phone instead of using the cellular networks voicemail feature because uh, this will be on the device we've got some ai integrations as well and i'm sure samsung will improve this feature in the coming days uh, let me know your thoughts about this what do you think about this voicemail feature uh, the direct voicemail feature uh, drop a comment share your thoughts and while you do that be sure to subscribe to the channel this is the place you need to be if you want to know more about your galaxy devices and uh, give this video a like if you find this video informative thanks for watching you guys take care and stay safe i'll see you in the next one soon cheers bye bye